He is now set to be Kenya's most powerful man, the president. And although he has not been sworn in yet, the trappings of power are already apparent. He arrived in style with a motorcade surrounded by tight security. As soon as he entered the auditorium, Uhuru Kenyatta's presence was appreciated by many who were here, the crowd ecstatic, each person straining to personally congratulate the president-elect. The media too was not left behind, from local to international media. This was a historic moment for Kenya and the world at large. And finally, it gives me great pleasure now to give to the president-elect the certificate of the results. Thank you very much. Thank you. IEBC Chairman Isaac Hassan presented the presidential election certificate to Uhuru Kenyatta, officially terming him the president-elect. The national tallying at Bomas of Kenya was a tedious exercise, as admitted by IEBC Chief Executive Officer James Oswago. His sentiments echoed by Chair Isaac Hassan, who assured Kenyans that the process was credible and transparent and apologized for the delays that had occurred. If there was a time we needed a partner to moderate the rising temperatures, this was it. And the local media came through in a, in a special way. <clears throat> they handled issues with modesty and professionalism. Some radio stations decided to run a go-to-work campaigns, even as IBC was continuing to count and tally the results. Others were tweeting a very interesting message saying, to now let's wait. Uhuru Kenyatta managed to garner more than half of the total votes cast and a percentage of 25% in majority of the counties as stipulated in Article 4 of the Constitution. From when voting began in March 4th up until now, it's the 9th day of March and people have been waiting for this day anxiously and in expectation. And indeed, it is a defining moment for the Kenyans and for the Kenyan history. Finally, and it is now official that Uhuru Mugai Kenyatta is the pre president-elect and he has been given that certificate by IEBC chairman Isaac Hassan. Now, of course, jubilation across the country people are excited people are happy and yes we are yet to see what exactly will Uhuru Kenyatta do for this country and many eyes are on him right now for KISS TV News I am Melin Miendo